Good morning guys, Pit Bite Sonic here. Today's video, we're here at Ella Park for I think is round five of the British Mini Bikes Championship. I haven't done a British Mini Bikes Championship or a summer round in about six years. I think Fullbeck was the last time I did a summer BMB round. So really looking forward to coming back to BMB, seeing what it's like and uh, giving it a good go. Um, should be interesting. I know absolutely no one here. I don't know what the competition's like. I know absolutely nothing. So today is Saturday. We've got no racing today. We've got three practices and one qualifying. And then tomorrow, which is Sunday, we have got another qualifying and three races. So three races all crammed in one day. It's going to be a busy day. But looking forward to it. We've got a garage here, as you can see. Thanking KHR Racing. And they also have bought us brand new rubber underneath those tyre warmers so massive thank you to him this whole video is dedicated to him um, and a massive help that he has done there's his van outside there so massive thank you to Kai at KHR Racing also all my other sponsors we had a practice day here yesterday um, obviously Ella Park they sponsor me so thank you for you guys for letting me use the track yesterday um, really mega um got down to some good times on knackered tires uh, we got down to a 51 dead my previous best round here is a 50.9 so only one tenth off uh with what i'd like to say knackered tires so hopefully we'll knock a few more temps off with some new ones today weather is gorgeous um it may rain tomorrow which is a bit unfortunate i haven't done a lot of practice around here in the rain but it's gonna be the same for everyone um but it's gonna be yeah weird conditions because because it's so hot it will dry quickly so i think we may be on the uh pmtrs but we'll see how we go we'll do some practicing i'll get wendy to do some filming i'll stick the gopro on and i'll speak to you guys later
right guys, so we've done all our practice sessions day today. We've done three of them and we've topped all three. We've even beaten my PB as well, so mega. Um, we're now going into the first qualifying. We also have one in the morning, but by looking for the weather forecast, this is the only one that's gonna count because I reckon tomorrow's qualifying might be wet. So really happy that we've topped all of them, beat PB, but this one, I'm gonna take my brain out a bit. We're still a few tenths off what the pole position was at Fab a few months ago, so want to go uh, smash that so we're gonna take my brain out for this last one have to do the fastest lap in the first three laps really because if you don't you just land up catching all the slower riders back up and there uh, it's a bit of a game over session then you don't really get a clean lap so go out here absolutely smash it hopefully we can uh, be just beat any of my time so we did a 50.7 so anything quicker than that it'd be mega and um, we've also got Michael Med out there now who's one of the quick 140 boys I think he's had a few transponder problems all day I think he's gonna have it sorted for this qualified session so uh, might have to watch out for him speak to you guys at the end of the day guys so that's the end of saturday here at ella park for bnb round five my first bnb round since 2016 i think summer round anyway good day topped every session pole position at the moment we have got another qualifying tomorrow um, but we're pole by two temps over michael med and i've set my pb round in not 0 0.3 of a second off so well happy with that 50.6 pole position here at fab was 50.4 so yeah really happy with that 
Um, uh, the weather, it looks like it's going to be wet tomorrow, so all this dry practice and riding could be pretty pointless, but we'll see. Hopefully it stays dry and the weatherman is wrong, but... It'd be nice to get some wins tomorrow, but I've been a bit unlucky on that front, but even some podiums would be nice as well, but hey-ho. Sorry the vlogging's been a bit shit this weekend. Um, they don't have live stream at b, &B and also Wendy is not here because she's feeling a bit under the weather, so... You've only been getting me chatting and the onboards as well, so hey ho. Right, we're gonna go home, have a shower, and I'll catch you first thing in the morning. Bye. Right, good morning guys. Sunday. Now on the way to the track, Ella Park, um, for a qualifying and three races. Um the rain has stayed away at the moment, as you can see. So Hopefully it's going to stay away for the rest of the day, but I think at some point it is going to rain. Um, it has got better, the weather forecast over the night, but I still think it's going to rain at some point. So we're going to now take the short drive to the track. I'll get some fuel on the way as well, because I've ran out and might as well get some as well for Landau next weekend. So Yeah, feeling a bit nervous this morning. It's been a long, long while since I've been on pole position. I think it's when I last won a race uh, with Fab at Ella Park. So yeah, feeling a bit nervous, but... I'm just going to go out and enjoy it. Hopefully the rain stays away. That's the thing that I'm fingers crossed over. Right, let's get to the track, guys. I'll speak to you in a bit. happened the rain is here so the bike wheels are out we're just going to leave it now till the last 10 minutes to decide what we're going to do whether we're going to go wet or if we're going to go slick ours but it's still pouring with rain so i think we're probably going to go in full wet so this is going to be a disaster i tell you no one has had any practice in the wet it's been dry all weekend all friday all saturday and the first session out for a race is going to be pouring with rain. It says it's going to stop at two o'clock and then there's going to be no more rain. So I'm predicting this race is going to be fully wet. Second race is going to be damp. And the last race at around, probably going to be around about six o'clock at this rate, uh, is probably going to be fully dry. So we're going to get one of each. So see how we go. In that final qualifying, we also kept the pole position. So we are on pole for the race, but first time riding this CW in the wet and it's going to be in a race. So it's going to be interesting. No idea what to expect, but we'll see how we get on. Speak to you guys later.
So we did our first race about an hour ago in the sodding rain and we came second. So I'm pretty happy with that. I wanted to win, but hey ho, that was the first ever time I've ridden the CW in the wet. Happy with my result. We only finished about 1.5 off Ben Lord, so pretty happy with that. It was carnage, the race. It was like a demolition derby. So many people crashing. And then on the last few laps, someone has decided to dump oil completely all the way around the track. And that hour ago, since our race has been, there hasn't been a group out since. And they have put a message out saying, possibly could be the end of the day um, because it's extremely hard to clean oil up in really really wet conditions because you can't put sand on it because you'll just make it worse so at the moment um, I don't know if we're going to get another race we're just going to be unhappy uh, I'm a bit disappointed with because I really really want a dry race because I feel pretty confident in a dry race we can go out and win but we'll see how it goes I'm still happy with this weekend's performance and how I've ridden we topped every single session in the dry so uh, just see how it goes um, and hopefully speak to you guys later. I'll get Wendy to do a bit of filming if we have a dry race and I'll get her to do, uh, film my presentation. But until then, I have no idea what's going on. See you later guys. Right, back again. It's now half past three and we still haven't gone out for our second race. They've canceled all the junior classes now because they don't want to risk it um, because the track is just so slippery because of the oil and uh, we've had another big downpour. It is still raining at the moment. Um, but all the adult classes can go out on their own discretion. Um, it's no championship points, not that that really matters to me because I don't compete in BNB. Um, so I'm going to go out, see how I go. A wet oily track is never good, uh, but we'll see how we go. Um, I don't know if I can, if I do win, can I really count that as a BNB win? I don't know. Um, but we'll see how we go. We're going to go out, just have a laugh. I'm going to try and not crash because we're at Landau. We leave for Landau on Thursday night and I have got no time to fix it if I break anything. So I really don't want to throw it down the road. So I'm not going to be pushing too hard. But we'll see how we go. I'll have the GoPro on. I'll try and get Wendy to do a bit of filming because she's done... Oh, I haven't got any footage of me actually going around the track on my bike this weekend yet, so I'll try and get Wendy to do something. Speak to you later. Right guys, so that was it. Um, we didn't get really another race. That first one where we came second behind Ben. We went out for a little friendly race afterwards um, and I <laughs> dropped from first to second, back to first. And then on the last lap, I had um, a collision with another rider. He was catching me extremely quickly. I did go defensive. We just crossed lines and unfortunately I come off. No damage to myself, no damage to the bike. I'm all good, ready to go for Landau next weekend. Um, so yeah, real shame, real shame. After winning, oh, winning. After leading every session all the weekend, all of Saturday, being first in both qualifiers, and then it rains for the race and just ruins the whole thing, really. I really wanted to get my first BNB win um, and do the hat trick. So I had a win in Fab, Nora Sport and BNB. Means I'm gonna have to come do another BNB round. Bit gutted. Um, 
but not having a race on Saturdays when things like this happens um, when you try and cram all three races in a day this is what happens so yeah um, a b and b you need to put a race in on Saturdays because when stuff like this happens just mucks it up um, and we would have got two races today if they had already had one on Saturday but hey ho Sorry, this has bit of a, been a bit of a shit vlog, really. Not really had a lot of filming, and I've lost see like there's no live streaming at B and B, so um, it's been a bit poor. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching as always. If you've enjoyed this average video of pit bike racing here at Ella Park, click the subscribe button here, and if you want to watch some more videos, hit this button here. Cheers, guys, for watching. Land out next weekend. Obviously, we'll be doing a vlog there. See you later, guys. Bye bye.